Hi guys, it is currently Wednesday the 16th of October and I'm in the middle of a work week and I haven't vlogged the first two days of this week because Simon's been off this week and we've been having a little bit of family time and I've just been doing like kind of small business tasks rather than a lot of actual work. Um, this morning though, or this afternoon, I have just sat down and just edited today's studio vlog, or last week's one, you guys would have already seen it, hopefully, fingers crossed. Also, let me know what you guys are thinking of those studio vlogs, like, are you enjoying them? What kind of stuff do you want to see me do? Um, because I would really like to know that kind of thing. Um, but yeah, I've just edited that studio vlog and i'm just about to package some orders but monday i spent some time designing a, a repeat pattern for my sketchbooks or my notebooks which are going into production they're actually being produced as we speak they should be here next sometime next week so i have a brand new product to show you guys which i'm super duper excited about but yeah the rest of today i'm actually going to do some planning I'm um, going to sit down and perhaps have a business meeting with Simon, just discuss a few things. I still need to do that email newsletter thing as well <laughs> about my shop because um, I've got some, got the notebooks coming and I've got some of those pencils as well which I'm going to be adding to my shop. So they all, I need like the email list set up so that I can notify people about that kind of thing that are interested. <laughs> So I really need to get on top of that. Also, I have changed my hair. As you probably noticed, it's a lot darker. And I've just kind of done the ends so they're funky coloured now, rather than the front. And I feel like it, it makes me look a little bit more tan, a little bit more alive. <laughs> Let me know what you think of that as well. But there's not going to be much to this week's studio vlog because, as I said, I'm just kind of spending a, a bit of time with family and not actually doing a whole lot. But any kind of bits that I do do I will obviously film for you guys um, but yeah I've just got this video this studio vlog which is exporting it's not gonna take too long I just need to make a thumbnail for that and also a thumbnail for the art snacks video on Friday so I'll just show you guys real quick the uh, pattern that I've created um, for the notebooks I went with the bumblebee in the end because I feel like that will probably be the most popular and uh, kind of see like all round not necessarily just seasonal um, also feel like it's something that a lot of people are interested in lately so this is the repeating pattern that I actually made for that you can see like it just repeats all the way over and then I've just got the logo and um, what it is information that kind of stuff that I put on my cards all of that kind of thing is on there I'm really excited to see what these are like and these are going to be plain inside and just kind of soft soft covered little notebook so you can use it like as a sketchbook you can use it for notes you can use it for bullet journaling I wanted to go with the plain initially but I can also do lined dotted and squared paper I believe so I might see if there's any kind of interest for those types of papers as well especially the dotted ones because I myself like to do some bullet journaling so uh, maybe other people want to do that kind of thing with my um, coloured pencil designs on the front I don't know uh, let me know what you guys think about that in the comments below as well but I'm gonna get on and design a two thumbnails one for the arts next video friday and one for this studio vlog which i'm just exporting now which is actually almost done so i'll take you through that process also i just moved the camera and this is much better light to film in <laughs> why didn't i put the camera here to begin with you got a nice view of althea the fern as well there oh well
Good morning. It is good afternoon. Currently Friday. It's the end of the week. I don't think I vlogged yesterday. No, I didn't. Um, today, uh, this week, the only two times I've vlogged are Wednesday and today. Uh, mainly because it's just been a slow week, as I said. It's just been spending some time with family. And I apologise if you can't hear me over the rain. Um, which has been quite a slow week. Um, yesterday I spent some time and I actually managed to get my mailing list for my shop sorted. I will leave a link to that in the description if you want to join that because I have a 15% discount code for life for all orders, all future orders that you place on my website. And I'm also going to enable it for my Etsy store as well. Um, so if you want to sign up to that I'll leave a link in the description because it's finally up and running, yay! <laughs> Um, today I have ordered a load more packaging supplies from Amazon. I've had a delivery of some more yellow envelopes because I was running really low. Today I should have a delivery of some A4 envelopes and some other bits and pieces and I've also got some more of these. I've got some more of these little silver scratch off stickers because I put those on myself on my scratch cards. It's now hailing. Well, I think there's a little bit of a storm on the way. <laughs> that was uh, that was some hail. It's still going, but it's not quite as bad. Was it thunder? I thought it was just a really loud blow of wind. So all that's kind of on the agenda for today is to put the little circles on my scratch cards and pack up some orders and just do some kind of admin stuff so that's pretty much it for today find the best match for your search. Search engines can now also consider the searcher's geographic location to prioritise. It's natural to want to tackle the items that will give you the biggest bang first, but be realistic. Adding an entire section about sustainable farming methods to your site might require hiring a programmer to help, which might cost a fair bit. In the short term, you could post a quick article about the topic on your blog. The next step, give yourself a deadline. 